Thank you so much for joining for another video. This is Arlene Sings. Please don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment the link below. And if you're new to my channel, thank you so much for joining me and welcome you to my channel. Today, I'm having a challenge. I was watching uh, yesterday, um, Miss Sugar. She did the Rice Krispie Challenge. So she said that if somebody would, she would do a challenge of so somebody will have a ketchup sandwich, which I did reply I would. And then I also replied that when I was a kid, I mean, my brother always used to have mayo sandwiches. It's something we had, and if we were hungry, that's what we have at nighttime. So now I like my doing the uh, ketchup sandwich. It's just ketchup, ketchup, ketchup. But I'm also doing the mayo sandwich. It's just mayo. I don't know if you guys can see it. I should have just brought the whole thing here and made it here. That way you guys can see it's mayo. But that is mayo. So if anybody wants to do that challenge, I'm doing the ketchup challenge. Or because I also do mayo sandwiches i also incorporate my mayo sandwiches and i'm also going to have my boiled eggs with my chili sweet chili oil yummy 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 so i'm going to have that my ranch sweet chili oil so i'm going to go ahead and start beginning and i'm also of course i'm not having coffee today i'm having ice grape juice which is grape juice is one of my favorite juices so i'm going to have some of that with me as my comfort food on my comfort drink so because it's a challenge I'm gonna start with a ketchup sandwich again guys it's just pure ketchup told you I told you miss sugar I would do it I'm gonna do it right now mm -hmm. I don't mind ketchup sandwiches again just ketchup And if I have my egg, <laughs> that is so good. I don't see what the problem having ketchup sandwiches. I know it's plain, but if you put ketchup on your sandwiches, I know you have meat and all that stuff. Obviously, you don't mind ketchup on your sandwiches. The same thing with all the extras. That's why I see it. Same thing with mayo. Mm. I don't mind ketchup sandwiches. I don't mind. I like them. I like them. Mm. <laughs> Hope you guys are having a good day. I'm having a good day. My wife's at work, so we're doing this solo. And I don't think my wife likes ketchup or mayo sandwiches. Up, so I'm kind of glad I'm doing this one by myself. Cheers! I'm gonna have me eggs with the sweet ranch chili oil oh, and chili chili sauce. Mm. Mm. So good, 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 good. Now I'm going to finish my mayo sandwich. <laughs> so if any of you guys want to do a mayo or ketchup sandwich, let me know. Because I'm doing mine challenge. It's a challenge. Yep. Yep. Not a bad challenge at all. Mm. I'm enjoying it. With my icy grape juice. Put my having one more egg before I start my mayo sandwich. That way it cleans my palate a little bit. And I can just taste the mayo after having my egg. I love it! Grape juice is such a beautiful juice. I just love it. Mm. 
I'm ready for a mail sandwich. Memories. I like it. I had this as I was a children. I really dig it. And I know that if you watch this, that's my bro. I used to always send my brother for another mother. People actually believe it. I was just kidding. We had the same mom and dad. But anyways, I know that is going to bring some memories because I know you and I like mayo sandwiches because we used to always have it in Argentina. So I'm sure you're going to appreciate this. Okay, now I'll be going back to me egg. My egg with a sweet ranch. Sauce. My favorite, favorite sauce in the world. My favorite sauce. Okay. And because I don't want to cheat, because you know, if I really didn't like it, I could always dip it all into my sauce. My favorite, you know, red sauce, not red sauce, but my favorite, you know, my favorite sauce for instead of putting tapatio, I put that instead. So I could be doing that with my favorite sauce, but I'm not. I'm going to have it like this. This is really good. But today I found out Mr. Fritz, I believe I'm really bad at names, guys. But my wife came all excited and finally um following um you know, zombie girl eat. And then we found out that one of the people that were following is her dad. So the reason we found out because we saw the video with her and her dad. Mr. Fritz, I believe it's called again, Mrs. Zombie. You know, girl eat. I'm bad at names, but I do know who it is. And that was actually cool that we found that out. My wife was very excited. She's the one that actually saw it first. I was watching it, but she was like, do you know that's your dad? And I go, man, that's awesome. Okay, I'm going to dip now because I don't want to go let go of this beautiful, nice sauce that I have left over here. So just for one little bite, just to clean it up. I can't let that go. <clears throat> so anyways, that was kind of nice. Mm -hmm. Okay, like I said, guys, I have no problem eating ketchup sandwiches, mayo sandwiches, I'll eat mustard sandwich. True story. So one day, when I was what, 15, 16, I was going to high school, you know? So my mom always buy us, you know, those little frozen burritos, you know, it costs, back then it costs like 25 cents each. So my mom always had a bunch of them in the fridge because she knew I always used to come, you know, home hungry. And I uh, would put one or two in the microwave and have my little burrito until my mom came from work. Um, and then she would cook dinner like hours later. So when they were out of condiments, we have no ketchup, no hot sauce, no nothing. The only thing we have in the fridge is mustard. So I don't know if you guys ever had those little mini, you know, frozen burritos without any sauce. It's kind of like, doesn't have much great taste. So I put the mustard and I go, man, I'm going to try it. I put it all over my burrito. I didn't think I was going to like it. I kind of digged it. It didn't taste bad, you know? I thought it was going to be like, ugh, you know, being, bur being a cheap burrito with mustard. Anyways, I'm kind of weird like that, guys. But, I mean, I don't go out of my way to have a mustard with burrito, frozen burritos. But if I had to, I know I can survive it. And I appreciate it and I would like it. So, anyways, I don't know if any of you guys ever had that experience. If you ever had... Those little frozen burritos we ever put ketchup no i'm not ketchup mustard or any kind of thing weird you know other that's not usually you know related or we never contemplate putting 
mustard on a frozen burrito. So if you guys ever had any kind of weird condiment pudding on kind of anything, just you can always comment in the link below. But like I said, I will try pretty much almost anything. And if I like it, I'll eat it. If not, you know, at least I'll try it and I'll go, hey, I hate it. Like I did with this pumpkin spice coffee, which I actually did dig that um, the other day. I did dig that, that cold one, so that was cool. Need last bite? Mm, 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 mm. Cheers, guys. Cheers, 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 cheers. <laughs> My last bite. <laughs> Anyways, guys, that was it. I had my ketchup sandwich challenge, Miss Sugar. I ate it and it was pretty good to me. I also had my mayo sandwich, so I'm challenging. Anybody out there other than my brother because I know he likes it. I challenge anybody out there to do a mayo sandwich. Just mayo and bread. That's it. And I love it. So anyway, guys, um, thank you so much for joining me again on my weird experience and my weird challenge. But I did dig it. Don't know about you guys. So I want to thank you so much for watching. Again, if you like my video, please give it a thumbs up. And then please don't forget to ring 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 the bell ring the bell and put it to all the way you don't miss any of my uploads thank you so much for joining me until next time peace